can't be hurried, and waiting's no fun. But when you keep busy, soon the waiting's all done. Get ready in the outfield. This one's going to be a whopper. I got it, I got it. Wow! Ta-da! Told you I got it. <gasps> Sister, your fur. What? I didn't know it was a thistle bush. Hey, you made the catch. Oh, I wish there were another way to get all these burrs out, but... I'm never falling into a thistle bush again. Especially now that I'm going to be bald. You're going to be bald? No, Sister is not going to be bald. That's the last of them. No burrs and no bald. What about my ribbon? You'll have to wait for your fur to grow back a bit before we can put the ribbon back in. But I look silly without my ribbon. Well, I think you look pretty as a picture, with or without it. <gasps> picture? Oh, no! It's picture day at school next week. Will my fur grow back by then, Mama? Well, fur grows when it grows. You can't make it grow faster. You have to be patient. Okay, I'll try to be patient, but it's not going to be easy. aren't allowed in class, sister. You better take it off before Professor Actual Factual sees you. Professor Actual Factual? He's our substitute teacher today. Your fur doesn't look so bad. You made it sound a lot worse on the phone. Hey, it looks cool, sister. Like something I saw in Teen Bear magazine. It's a new style. Well, sort of. Thanks, but I know my fur looks silly. It's even too short for my ribbon. I just hope it grows back before picture day. Good morning, class. I thought it would be fun today to learn a bit about botany, the science of plants. Now everyone gets a seed pot. But they're yogurt cups, Professor. Recycled yogurt cups, Queenie. They can be used for all sorts of useful things, like seed pots. And we have all sorts of seeds here. Any seed will do. With lots of light for photosynthesis, some water and good soil, this seed will turn into something like this. Wow! What's photosynthesis? Photosynthesis is when plants use energy from sunlight to make the compounds they need to grow. Are we going to grow our own plants, Professor? <laughs> you bet. Help yourselves. Look, Mama. We planted seeds in school today. The Professor says if we give it water and lots of light for photosynthesis, it'll grow into a plant. How long do you think it'll take, Mama? Well, you might have to give it a little patience, too, because plants take a while to grow. <sighs> okay, I'll try to be patient. Now, dear, you know that staring at your plant won't make it grow any faster. <sighs> I could use some help cutting these cookies. 
Okay. I don't understand it. Everyone's plant has started to grow except mine. Lizzie's even has a flower. Perhaps your plant needs a little more time. But I have to take it back to class on Monday. The professor's coming back to see how our plants are doing. Everyone's going to see that mine isn't doing anything. And Monday is picture day, too. Lizzie has a new ribbon, so she'll look extra pretty. And I'm just going to look extra silly. I'm afraid your fur will grow when it grows, and not a moment before. It's the same with your plant. All you can do is wait, and try to be patient. But being patient is hard, Mama. I don't want to wait. I want it to happen now. Maybe your fishing day with Gramps will help take your mind off it. Oh, I don't feel like fishing. But Gramps will be here any minute to pick you up. Okay, but I'm not going to let him see my silly fur. Mm-hmm. That's good. Mm. Nothing like your mama's cookies. These taste so good, I bet you must have helped with them. <sighs> You know, if there's something on your mind, I can't think of a better place to talk about it than here at our old fishing tree. After all, it is our special place. It's just that it's picture day at school on Monday, and I got some burrs in my fur, and Mama had to cut them out, and now everyone's going to have a picture of how silly my fur looks. Oh, I don't know. It looks kind of cute to me, kind of modern. And we planted seeds for school, and like my fur, my plant isn't growing either. I've been waiting for a whole week, Gramps. A whole week. It sure is upsetting when things don't happen as fast as you want them to. But still, there are some things you just can't hurry. So you just have to be patient. That's what Mama says. But I can't help it, Gramps. I want it to happen now. <laughs> I know exactly how you feel. I found it really hard to wait for things when I was young, too. You did? Yep. Way back before our fishing tree was even here. You see, I planted it. You planted the fishing tree, Gramps? But I thought it was here forever. <laughs> well, not quite forever. Anyway, it sure taught me about being patient. Well, at first, I thought it was going to sprout right away. Like something out of Jack and the Beanstalk. But nothing happened. Still, I kept coming back again and again. It felt like it was taking forever. Finally, I found something to keep myself busy, to take my mind off all the waiting. Before I knew it, the time had passed and the tree started to grow. It grew bigger and bigger and bigger. And that's how this old tree taught me about being patient. I learned that there's no use getting all upset and frazzled when things don't happen right away. Because there's nothing we can do to make things happen faster. All we can do is wait and be patient. That's right. Waiting is really hard, but if you find something to do while you're waiting, it makes the time pass faster. Like fishing. So instead of waiting, let's do some fishing, Gramps. You don't want to forget these, sister. I'm sure it will sprout soon. It just needs more time. I know. It'll grow when it grows, and nothing will make it grow any faster. I can be patient. I don't need that today, Mama. Thanks. Not sure why your plant didn't sprout yet, sister. Did you water it and put it in the sunlight? Yes, Professor. Hmm. Exactly what kind of seed did you plant? Uh, one that I brought in, or...? A seed from the apple I had for lunch on the day you came in. <laughs> Why, sister, no wonder it hasn't sprouted yet. You're growing an apple tree. Trees take much longer to grow than the ordinary flowers the rest of the class planted. You mean it's going to be a tree just like Gramps' fishing tree? Well, I can't 
say I've ever heard of a fishing tree before. <laughs> Would you like to try a flower seed? I promise you it'll grow in no time. No, thank you, Professor. I'll just wait for my apple tree. It might take a long, long time to grow, but some things you just can't hurry. You just have to wait. I know how to be patient. Teacher Jane's class, please come to the gym for your class picture. Aren't you coming, sister? Oh, I forgot that it was picture day. <sighs> oh, well, here goes. Yes, sirree. Cute as a button. A button with funny fur. But now it's all grown back. And that's not the only thing that's grown, Gramps. Ta-da! Look at my apple tree. So, when anyone comes here, they'll have the fishing tree to rest on and give them shade, and they'll have an apple tree to give them a nice, juicy snack. It'll be a while before that happens. But one thing's for sure, your grandchildren will come here someday to enjoy your tree and its apples. Our trees, Gramps. But until then, while we're waiting... I couldn't think of a better way to pass the time. <laughs>